Here we go to the tail of the trip. The captain, Dhruv Chaudhary, from the Bengaluru Tigers, takes on Sanjeev Budwar from the Delhi Heroes in this Bantamweight contest. Both fighters made in approximately the same weight. Huge height and reach advantage to the captain of the Tigers. And now, ladies and gentlemen, introducing first, fighting out of the black corner, his style, Taekwondo, Karate, and Muay Thai. He weighs in at 61 kilograms, representing the Bengaluru Tigers. Make some noise for Drew Psycho Chandra! And his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, his style, Wushu and mixed martial arts. He weighed in at 61 kilograms, representing the Delhi Heroes. Give it up for Sanjeev Boudoir! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the referee for the fight, Ryan Torch. Here we go, fight number one, bantamweight division, semi-final number one, Bengaluru Tigers, Delhi Heroes, the winner gets a spot in the final. Everything on the line, it's all been building up to this and it's about to get underway, my man. And you know what, every cliche in the book applies tonight. <laughs> <laughs> and we're gonna use all of them. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> I mean, this is such a difficult position Sanjeev is in right now because it's pick your poison with Drew, and anything can happen in this game. And Sanjeev's got skills and experience both as an amateur and as a pro, but he's going to have to be so selective with the offensive techniques that he chooses to implement. You know, one thing I'll say that uh, about Sanjeev, though, he packs a lot of power in those strikes. And sometimes, you've seen it so many times in MMA, a well-rounded fighter can get tagged early, and that changes everything. Nice counter with an overhand right from Sanji to Drew as he went in for that leg kick. Again, it looks like he's got his timing working for him already. Drew Look getting a little that. sloppy with those hooks on the inside. Drew better be careful here because he doesn't want to stand and trade with Sanji Budwar. You can see sanji has got his hands low. Another chop and kick from the outside. Drew trying to establish some range, but good subtle movement from Sanji thus far to stay out of those strikes reach. We've said it before, the kind of fighter to take on Drew is somebody who would put the pressure on him. A shot to the body. Oh, comes over with a nice straight left. Yeah, he clipped him with that last strike, and pressure is all over him. You hit that on the head. But Drew trying to turn things around. He's got an over-under right now. Sanji does a good job of separating from that clinch. Great job by Sanjit. But you know what? This is what happens with strikers like Sanjit Budwa. He's very, very dangerous in that opening frame. Both of these fighters are throwing a lot of hooks once they get in the pocket. And a straight punch will beat that hook every time, so you got to be careful with that technique. However, you can get a ton of power on those strikes, too. So if one of them touches you, you could be waking up on the mat. Oh, look at this big body shot. That might have hurt Dhruv. Dhruv is backing up. I've never seen Dhruv back up so much so quickly. All sorts of pressure from Sanji early in this fight. He's feeling comfortable. He looks relaxed in there. He looks like he thinks he's got this man figured out right now, but there's still a lot of fight left. Oh, there's a lot of fight left in Dhruv Chodhi, but those body shots will pay dividend as this fight goes on. Drew shoots in for a takedown, or at least changes levels for a takedown without the drive, but very good awareness and very good hips from Sanji to defend that. Good knee on the exchange as well, and Drew needs to keep his hands up though. Man, he, he is teeing off on those body shots, Arjun. You know what, he's landing those body shots consecutively, and Drew's left hand has dropped down to protect that, protect that body. Which is what he wants, he's trying to draw that out so he can come back over the top with an overhand right. Drew needs to be careful, he looks a little bit befuddled in front of us. He does, he's got a little welt under his left eye as well. Drew needs to figure out his strategy here because he's been eating shots for the better part of this round. Straight strikes is what he needs, man. And oh, he, oh big right hurt. hand from Sanji. Oh, man. Drew is hurt. Drew is hurt. covering up. Oh, you know what? Drew here needs to be careful. He's eating some big strikes. He needs to cover his head up. He ate some clean shots to oh, the chin. Oh, man. He seems to be okay here. He's trying to get his composure back, but. Sanjeev is not giving him any room. He tried to throw a leg over for a triangle, but very sloppily. And Sanjeev taking his time and raining down some pistons to Drew Chaudhry right now. Oh, man, oh, man. With tons of time remaining in the round, he's eating some big shots Those here. Those are landing cleanly, Arjun. I'm not sure how much longer this fight's going to get carried no, on by Ref Ryan right now. Now, hear me. Now, that's a worse position for him right now. Completely turtled up oh, and wait, tapping. Oh, he tapped. 
Wow, he tapped the strikes. That's unbelievable. What an upset by Sanjay Budwar. Sanjay Budwar comes out here and gets the captain of the Bengaluru Tigers to tap to strikes. I cannot Man. believe what we just saw. What an incredible performance and what a way to get this show started for the Delhi Heroes. Man, oh man, you know what? A lot of people expected Drup Chaudhary to come up, but like you said, he got befuddled early and these were just academically on the point. I think Drup was out of it. He was hurting a lot from those shots, but he's such a gamer, he's such a tough guy. He took those shots, but I think he had, I think it was those body shots that started the ball rolling. Yeah, I mean, all in all, it was the forward pressure. He came in with a lot of pressure, was very composed, take his shots, calculated, and he opened up when he needed to open up at the right time. Drew was on his back foot, and Drew was returning with hooks. He wasn't throwing any straight strikes. That was not the counter you wanted to see from Chaudhry, and what an upset we just witnessed. Incredible. What a fight to get this night started. Four big points. Let's quickly go for the final results inside the cage. Ladies and gentlemen, Ref Ryan calls a stop to the fight in the first round in two minutes and 52 seconds. Declaring the winner by TKO from the Delhi Heroes, Sanji Budwar! All right, all right. All right, all right. Very first match of the semi-finale of MTV Super Fight League. और बहुत ही बेहतरीन तरीके से इन्होंने match जीत ली है. How does it feel? कैसा लग रहा है आपको? जब जब बाकी बस हरे भगवान है. अरे अरे भी आओ भाई बस. All right. Give it up for Sanjeev, ladies and gentlemen. You know what? Sanjeev Bhagwan came out and did exactly what he wanted to do, and he did it. Groom is a tough, tough guy, and he made it look easy. He was not intimidated at all by the mystique of the captain of the Bangalore nope. Tigers. Had a game plan, came out here, stuck to it with confidence, with looseness, and with some vigor. And what? I'm still shocked that we just.